y'all. I'm Barbie from Barbie in the Cave Band, where a balanced table is a happy table. Now, I'm a casual vegan, my husband is a strict carnivore, and my little egg is complicated. So my purpose is to incorporate more fruits and veggies into every diet by offering vegan recipes with variations for every diet. So join me today on the newest episode of Barbie and the Caveman. Hey y'all, thanks for joining me for this Thanksgiving Day episode of Barbie and the Caveman. Now I'm gonna take you on a little tour of what I'm serving for this vegan Thanksgiving. And my guests aren't quite here yet, so I'll have a little time later to come back and show you the roast when it's finished. And some of my friends are also bringing some dishes that I'll highlight as well. And remember that the recipes are in the comments so that you can make these for your family too. Now our first dish on the walkthrough is the dressing and gravy. Now this dressing is my grandmother's recipe and it has eggs in it, but I just left the eggs out and substituted some blended flax seeds with water. And the gravy is of course just brown gravy and of course my grandmother's recipe as well. And no one should ever go a Thanksgiving, I feel, without a really nice brown gravy. The next thing I'm serving is a kale and Brussels sprout salad. Now recently I test drove this at the Veg Club event at my school and the teenagers loved it. It is shredded Brussels sprouts with some shredded kale, some cranberries, and right before I serve it, I'm gonna put on some candied pecans right across the top that are still warm from the stove top. So really terrific. Next is sweet potato souffle. Who doesn't love this? Now of course I have a big garden here um, near the cave and I grow these sweet potatoes. So I then blended them with some soy milk, some brown sugar, and layered it in the bottom of the pan. And then the topping is some um, oats with brown sugar and some knot butter. And then I layer the pecans over the top and cook it for a little while. It comes out beautifully fluffy and soft and it's delicious. You can also sprinkle some vegan marshmallows over the top, which is my preferred way, which will happen later, and we'll get toasted to a beautiful and delicious crunchy top that is oh so sweet and southern. Now here is some roast turkey. Well, but Barbie, this is a vegan Thanksgiving. Yes, but I have to feed the carnivore too. He can't just eat greens. So then this is a piece of roasted turkey. The way I do the turkey is I stuff it with sage and rosemary and apples and limes and oranges. It is really, really delicious, he says. And so I will believe him, but here we go. For our, I'm using the tofurkey roast. So it's in the oven right now, it's starting to smell delicious, but I will show you it before I serve it. Here is a pumpkin pie. Now I used the, pot, the pumpkin that was left over from my decorations from Halloween. So I cut up the entire pumpkin and roasted the entire pumpkin, took me about a day, and then froze it. And then this is the, the rest of the pumpkin that I used to create the pie. I have a visitor. <laughs> So notice that it's already disappearing. The little egg and the carnivore has hit this pretty hard. The last dessert on our walk is a southern banana pudding. I love this banana pudding. I found the, um, the pudding that is a vegan recipe um, at my local health food store. And then of course layered in the wafers. And they are just vanilla wafers. You can either make them or some grocery stores have them that are vegan with some bananas. So, puppies. So please join me back very soon. All right, all right, y'all. Here's the aftermath. It's the oh, most terrible bad. bit. Oh, it's terrible. I don't want to hear it. That was your third oh, play. God, that was your that third play. Yeah, uh, yeah. So here we go. Here we go. Sebastian ate two. He's already taken his plate in there to be. On behalf of Barbie and the Caveman, we wish you a happy Thanksgiving, y'all. Thanks for joining us for Thanksgiving, y'all. I hope you enjoyed all the recipes. Now, next on Christmas. See you soon on Barbie and the Caveman. <laughs>